this is Ivy here and today I'm coming on here to give you guys a first look at this hair that I just got and this hair is from Diamond Virgin Hair but first I want to tell everyone Happy New Year how was your holidays what y'all do I didn't do much over the holidays I had something here at my house with some of my fam and for New Year's I ended up being sick I had strep throats I was out of there. I couldn't do anything for New Year's, so I was at home. Me and Ricky just stayed home. So this New Year was blah. I had bought this real cute outfit. I bought some this sparkles top and these uh, rider jeans from the rider pants from American Apparel in gray. And I couldn't wear anything because I was so sick. But anyway, back to this beautiful hair. This is from Diamond Version Hair. This is the Brazilian Mink Hair. And I have mine in four bundles, 2626 and 2828. And yes, that's long as ever, but I always wear my hair long. So if you guys are new to my channel, I always wear long hair. It's, it's kind of like my thing. With this hair, I just wanted a center part, really nice and sleek. I kind of wanted it like um, the lady that was on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. I think her name was Marlo. I think her name was Marlo. And she had it uh, a center part and it was just long, black, and sleek. Now, this hair I did not color. This hair actually came dark like this. My real hair at the top, which you probably can see it, it's a little bit shinier than this hair. So this hair doesn't have a um, high gloss at all. My hair is just super, super shiny when I flat iron it. My hair has like a really high luster. Whenever I have hair that doesn't have a high luster, you kind of see it where it's um, blended in at the top. And I did make this hair into a V part, U part, and you have to sew it down. And I have just about this much hair left out. And I do have it so I can have a long part. Because I used to do my parts really short. But I like my part longer. It just looks better and more sleek to me. So this unit is sewn down. I only have this out and a little bit of my edges. But everything else is in for the most part. If you guys want to see how I attach a U part like this. Make sure you check the bottom bar. I will have a link below. When I first got this hair in the mail and I looked at it, I was really excited to put it in. It just feels very smooth and sleek. And it, I like it because it's none of those like fray hairs. It's like all super sleek all throughout. So I just wanted to come up close so you guys and kind of see the texture I was talking about. The hair is super sleek super super smooth and the ends of my hair look very good i didn't have to cut them they're nice and full they're, they're the same density from the top to the bottom and sometimes when you're getting straight hair or brazilian straight hair sometimes the ends might be kind of thin but these ends look very thick and for the most part my hair blends pretty good with it and i do have it in four bundles and it does seem a little bit thin but it's not thin to where it looks shabby, but it is a little bit thin, but that's okay. I kind of like when I have bone straight hair, when it's not too thick and when it's not thin. I kind of like it in that middle range where it looks kind of natural, like it could kind of be your own hair. And that's what it looks like. I mean, I have a pretty good fullness with four bundles. So if you want to get four bundles, you can pretty much get away with four. Unless you like your hair really full, you will probably need five. The, the hair does have a whole lot of body, a whole lot of movement. And I like that. Um, I'm glad that it's not stiff. So when I do want to curl it or something, it will have a lot of movement. And no, I don't plan on cutting this hair. I'll probably wear it like this. But when I have long straight hair, I pretty much wear it long and straight. Like that's just the way, I the way I like to do it. I plan on flexi riding it so it'll look um, really cute and bouncy and full with the length with some flexi rides. So I plan to have a flexi ride tutorial coming up soon. And so far I've had this hair in for about a week. Um, I haven't had any like tangling. I do get some shedding. Like the hair does shed. I should have sealed my wefts but I never seal them. I like to test the true integrity of the hair. With that being said, I am getting some shedding, but it's not like crazy 
I love to play shedding, but every time I brush it out, I do get some shedding. And with it being so long, I don't get tangles, but the hair does snag at the ends. I mean, the hair is almost 30 inches. I think it's longer than 28, honestly, because I always get 28s. And this just seems very, very long. Customer service is really nice. Um, I really love working with Diamond Virgin Hair. They're always friendly. They always answer emails and stuff. So I really like that. And the shipping is pretty fast. Uh, I got my hair within three days, three to five days, I think. Really, really fast. When you first get your hair, it just smells really nice. It doesn't smell like nasty, funky, nothing like that. It's very fresh and clean. I didn't even wash my hair before I put it in. And I always wash my hair. I just, you know, made my new part and put it on. Didn't wash it or nothing like that. So, um, yeah, it doesn't have a chemical smell. It's not making me break out. And it came black enough that I didn't have to dye it because my real hair is super jet black. I mean, you could probably see my real hair, the black right there in the front and stuff. So, um, yeah, but for the most part, it blends beautifully. And someone was interested, my lipstick is Punk Couture from MAC and I mixed it with some black lip liner. So it'll look something like this, like a really deep, dark purple. My necklace is from Melanie Asani. It says Scorpio. Yeah, so. Thanks so much for watching. Please don't forget to thumb me up, subscribe and comment, and talk to everybody soon.